What's good with my ninjas? Anime Analyst here with an hour to Storm 4 update for the story mode to be exact so according to this week's shonen jump magazine scheme on naruto storm 4 sasuke uchiha will be getting his own story mode in naruto storm 4 what i mean by that is that you're gonna you can go on the menu you will be able to pick sasuke story mode and naruto story mode so it's like two separate things so it's kind of like a dual perspective type situation so it has a quick little screenshot on the scan of how it looks when you click on Sasuke story mode so it's gonna have a picture of the character in the background and then it's gonna have like a trail along the page that has like all the different missions I'm guessing so you click on the mission to start it and then as you progress through the missions uh, the rest of the rest of the trail unlocks so I definitely think that this looks sick and also on the scan it has a recreation kind of a respin of when Sasuke revived the Hokage with Orochimaru and actually was asking them about what it means to be a shinobi and stuff like that so instead of actually talking to the Hokage like in the anime uh, the game respins it and has you actually using Sasuke Uchiha and fighting all the past Hokage and learning the information as you go so I definitely think uh, they're doing a kind of a original battles type thing where they're just putting in battles that really never happened just for the sake of the game's gameplay. And I think it looks sick because it has Sasuke uh, piercing through the first Hokage with his Chidori. And it actually has the first Hokage uh, kind of floating in the pieces with the Edo Tensei papers flying around. I don't know if they're going to add that paper effect for all the Edo Tensei characters. But I think that does look sick if they add it in a game. It says experience the game story mode. Histories Hokage shine a light on Sasuke's true ninja way so it says clash against the first Hokage and yeah it's definitely looking sick I can't wait for this dual perspective I think that it will be a definite plus for the game considering that in the past games you've really just taken on the the main role of Naruto's perspective during all the games and in terms of thinking and all that other stuff so it'll definitely be a uh, I think it'll definitely allow for more player personalized experiences considering you can go through the story with your favorite character Naruto or Sasuke personally you know I'm gonna go with Sasuke cuz Sasuke is just my dude so uh, yeah I can't wait to play these Sasuke battles I mean if they're adding in original battles there's no telling what other battles they could put that really never happened so it's kind of like a what if battles scenario so I definitely want to get my hands on this Sasuke story mode and not just the standard Naruto one so yeah people tell me your thoughts down below who would you which story mode would you do first would you go down Sasuke story mode first or would you fuck with Naruto story mode tell me down in the comments below uh, like the video and I'm out peace